Welcome back to KMOT First News at 10. I'm John Jacklin. After a two-game road trip this past weekend in western South Dakota, Minot State men's basketball is 9-0 as the team enters full NSIC play. The Beavers are outscoring opponents by more than 16 points per game. The undefeated start includes five neutral site games, two home games, and two true road contests. Senior guard Jalen Cook, who is second on the team in scoring, discusses the team's improvement since joining the program in 2021. Each year we've gotten better and better. I know like our first year, I think we lost in like the first round of the playoffs and each year we've been, uh, been getting better. So it's, it's really cool seeing the program grow over the time I've been here. And it's an exciting time for Minot State basketball. Now Minot State finished fourth in the NSIC last year before being one of the first teams left out of the national tournament. Head coach Matt Merkin says the Beavers have to learn from their non-conference wins in order to keep pace in a crowded, competitive conference. It's just a battle every night, you know, and that's that's what I've kind of been telling our guys is great start. You know, we've won all our games. That's great. Love being 9-0. and We better be better next week than we were this week because there's some teams coming up here that want to beat us. Minot State's leading scorer is Caleb Vandegreen, a junior forward from Bridgetown, Australia, and the NSIC Player of the Week. He says the main area for the Beavers to improve is in the clutch minutes. We've had a couple of close ones and our late game situations haven't been quite up to par to where we want it to be. I mean, we're doing well, but we just want to solidify that a bit more because we know when we get down the stretch, there's going to be a lot of one possession games and, you know, turn over here, turn over there could be the difference of the game. So we really want to be really solid late down the stretch of these games and put teams away. The Beavers are back on the court Friday night to host St. Cloud State. And we'll stick with basketball. Here's a look at some of the girls' basketball we have tomorrow night in the first night of many big nights in winter sports ahead. Ken Marbobels visits South Prairie in a B versus A matchup. Ned Rose travels to Bishop Ryan. DLB hosts Beulah. Turtle Mountain welcoming Hazen. Kildeer visits Stanley. And Velva heads west to Partial going to be a great year ahead. We'll be right back.